Hello and welcome. We are Tabletop Gaming Guild, and today uh, I am going to uh, try to teach these gentlemen the uh, game Glory to Rome. You guys ready for this? Let's do oh, it. Yeah. <laughs> Was I supposed to start singing? Uh, no, no, definitely don't. <laughs> no. All right. So Glory to Rome is a Charles Char classic. Uh, it's a card game. In this game, we all are influential uh, persons in the uh, ancient city of Rome. The Great Fire has just occurred in Rome, and Emperor Nero has decreed that we uh, must rebuild the city. So this is what the majority of the game is about. Um, you'll have a hand of cards, um, and on your turn, whoever... Whoever's turn it is gets this leader token. On your turn, you'll have to play uh, a card as a role. Um, and then each other player in order will have the opportunity to follow by playing the same kind of card. Or, or think, which uh, allows you to draw some cards. Uh, so, the... Various actions. Um, so, architect. Yep. Uh, the architect role allows you to move a card uh, from the pool, which is in the center of the table. There will be some uh, cards here in the center of the table that represent uh, things that we can grab. Um, I'm sorry, that's the patron uh, the architect allows you to move a card from your hand uh, and either create it as a site, so start a building, or to move a resource from your stockpile to a building to help uh, complete the structure. Um, so when you start a building, you'll take a card from your hand, any any card, uh, You'll start a building, uh, pick a spot, you know, in your play area where you want your buildings to be. Uh, you'll take one of these in-town sites uh, to match it with. Uh, so, like, that. So, if I'm starting this tavern, it's on this rubble site. This represents just a building in progress. If I... So that would be like one architect action. If I already had a rubble here in my stockpile, I could move that rubble to that building site and that would actually complete it. Um, and it was this one that I was building. There we go. When a building is completed, the site card goes here above your board. Uh, does this, oh, it does go under, excellent. Um, and increases your influence. So these coin icons represent influence. You start with two, and each building you complete is going to give you more. And influence is points at the end of the game, incidentally. Once a building is complete, you'll have access to whatever its special ability is. Uh, so the tavern's got a special ability there that refers to one of the other actions that I'll be going over here. The other action that you can do uh, to manipulate buildings and materials is the craftsman action. Or, I'm sorry, uh, craftsman. Do I have a craftsman? Yes, okay, craftsman. The craftsman action also allows you to start a building from your hand or add a resource to an already started building, but the, this time the resource comes from your hand instead of the stockpile. Um, the... While we're talking about the stockpile, let's talk about laborer. The laborer action 
allows you to take a resource from the pool, which again is the area in the middle of the board, and uh, take it into your stockpile. So you're claiming resources uh, so you can build buildings or do other things with them. The, the merchant action allows you to take resources from your stockpile and stick them in your vault. Now, when you take a resource from your stockpile, when you stick it into your vault, it goes face down. Your vault has a capacity. So you, there can't be more cards in your vault than your current influence. And at the end of the game, all the cards in your vault will score uh, victory points. So because this is a rubble card, it's got one coin on it, it's worth a point. Uh, plus there's like ma majority scoring over here. So the, whoever has the most rubble will get mm, three extra points. Whoever has the most marble will get three extra points, et cetera, et cetera. Now does that count? Uh, at the end of the game, yeah. That's just vault, right? That doesn't count what's underneath your card. Yeah, yeah so. that's right. Doesn't That's just what's in your vault. Is what those bonus points are looking at. Um, the patron action allows you to take a card from the center and stick it in your clientele. So um, each card, this is this is one of Charles Shuddock's, you know, things is these multi-use cards. Each card can be a building, um, a resource, or a client. Your clientele is also limited to your influence. So at the beginning of the game, you can only have um, two. And then as you build buildings, that will expand. But the, the, your clients will give you free actions. So if I've got a craftsman over here in my clients, then when somebody else plays a craftsman, I can play a craftsman and essentially craftsman twice, or I can choose to think which is the equivalent of doing nothing and still craftsman once. Um, that's an optional, but uh, these clients are really like part of the engine building of the game. That and building special powers, uh, which I will circle back to here in a minute. Um, so there's one action... Uh, this the legionary action is sort of like the attack action or the action that allows you to mess with your opponents in the game. So the way this works is you'll you'll play the legionary, you'll say, Hey, I'm doing legionary, and when you resolve it, you'll reveal another card from your hand. Uh, say I revealed this, I revealed a, a concrete, here is what matters, is the resource. So I will be able to take one concrete from the pool, the center of the table, and one concrete from the hand of the two people sitting next to me, uh, Pete and James in our current setup. And those resources that I steal from the center and other players go to my stockpile. This card that I've revealed goes back to my hand. And then you can uh, choose to think either as your, your main action or when following other people's action. If you think as your main action, uh, nobody else gets to follow. You, you just draw your cards and then you're done. Um, thinking, you can do three things with it. One, you can draw up to your hand size, which is normally five cards. Some buildings may modify your hand size. You can draw just a single card off the top of the deck randomly. Or you can take uh, a senator card, which are over here next to the deck. Um, the senator cards are basically a wild card. You can use a senator to lead or follow any role. Uh, and when you... When you play, normally when you play a card to lead or follow a role, it's going to fall into the center of the table, the pool. The the um, the senator card just goes back here over here in the supply. 
Okay. <clears throat> and then the game ends when one of two things happen. The either A, all of the in-town sites have been exhausted, which are these over here. Or uh, the deck is exhausted. We go through the entire deck. Okay. And then the person with the most influence wins. Um, and in, again, influence can come from built buildings, uh, cards that you've vaulted, and these, uh, these majority bonuses over here. All right. And uh, one final note that I always make when I'm teaching this game is this game is sort of known for its crazy combos. So if you see two buildings and it looks like they do something broken, uh, they probably do. <laughs> um, oh, one more thing, I guess I, I forgot there. Um, you have the option of I think it's called patrician it's it's not on these player boards uh, there's a reminder in the black box version we're playing with the classic arc to here today but you can if you want to lead or follow a role but you don't have the right kind of card you can play two cards that match colors to lead or follow any role I was going to say, it looks like they do have it mentioned here in the middle of the board, but it says oh, three okay. cards instead of two. So I don't know if that's a different version. Okay, yeah. Um, that's an interesting point because yeah, we're playing... Play cards. If, we're playing <laughs> if we're playing the original art version, they probably don't have the Republic rules. They probably have the Imperium rules. So uh, we'll go with two? <clears throat> or you want to go with three? All right, yeah, no, let's go with three. We'll play with the Imperium rules because I feel like that it's balanced properly or slightly better. Because um, uh, there are different cards in the deck if it, we are, in fact, playing with Imperium. Okay. So it's going to take three cards to petition. Um, and at the beginning of the game, instead of drawing five cards randomly, you'll have four cards plus a senator. Uh, as your starter in hand. Oh, okay. Um, okay. So, whoop. so we draw four cards, and then the center. Yeah, for some reason, I I drew one extra. So I'm just going to shuffle this back into the deck and uh, redraw four of those. Thank you, and one of those. All right. And then um, we each take one card from the deck and flip it into the pool to start the pool. I got tower. S. Okay. And these are just resources. So this is just concrete, marble, and marble, right? Um, in the pool, they cannot be buildings. They have to be either resources or they can be clients. Okay, so they're okay. So they're just either a patron or marble or an architect and concrete. And then we need yeah. one more. Yeah, somebody didn't do that yet. That was me. Okay. For so shame, I just take, Peter, for I just, shame. Yeah, I just take a card off the top here and flip it over. Yeah, put it into the middle. All right. Uh, and academy. All right. So. Um, the way the, the rule book is written is the, the player who go, who flips out the alphabetically first card is the one who goes first. Pete, do you feel okay going first? Or uh, you yeah, I'm good. pass I'm good. the opportunity? All right. No, I'm going to go first. Just this uh, is you, right? No. Two quick yeah. questions. Yeah, yeah. When you follow, you have to have that card in your hand, right? And then you lose that card? Yes. Okay. When you, then, when you play a card to lead or follow a role, just put it on your, the middle of your player mat. Okay. Um, and then the, the cards, after you're done resolving your effect, the cards go to the middle of the table for, for people to grab in future actions. And in the, uh, the last question is in your clientele, let's say I have like a legionnaire or a craftsman or a patron. How does that help me? 
So if you have a patron and you lead or follow a patron action, mm -hmm. you get basically a free patron action. So if it's in my clientele, I don't need to lose the card, basically? Yeah, like it. this card were here yeah. and your clients, and you played this card at, yes. <laughs> by leading a role, yeah. then you would be able to patron twice. Oh, I get to do the action twice. Okay. okay. Yes. All right. I think that was it. That was the only two things I Okay. I'm sure, uh, you know, some stuff will happen. So Peter goes first? Yes. All right. Ooh, I like that. I like that a lot. Oh, it's All right. A, so uh, four, I think. Let me double check here. Incidentally, um, wood and rubble are the easiest buildings to complete. They only take one resource to finish the building. Brick and concrete both take two resources to finish the building. And then marble and stone both take three resources to finish the building. Which looks like that's the influence. So you get yes, <clears throat> yeah. So that's good. Okay, so I am going to for my first turn uh, play my senator card, and that mm -hmm. means you can and do I can anything. choose any. I can choose any of the roles, and I'm going to choose laborer to move a card from the pool into my stockpile. Cool. And then I wait to see who's following and who's thinking. Uh, laborer. Let's see. I'm second, and I can claim one of these as a resource. Um, I will. I will choose to think. I'm just going to take my card and set it right there. That's the card I'm going to draw. I choose to lose. I'm going to use my senator to follow and steal this brick. Well, you don't take the card because yep. Pete gets first pick. No. Okay. Well, yep, yeah. I get first pick. But yeah, now okay. I know which one I'm getting. <laughs> I'm going to think and I'll take one card. There we go. There we go. What uh, was this again? This was, this uh, was laborer. laborer. Yeah, so All right. You're so, gonna, yeah. Uh, the way I usually play this is everyone like declares what they're doing and then everyone resolves in order. Uh, and the, the legionary specifically, it matters a lot about. So go go ahead, pick your resource, and I'll, yep. I'll draw so my I'm, card. So I'm going to take the concrete. Uh, that's the other one. All right, so I get to All take right. the brick. And this All goes right. into your stockpile. Yeah, put, the, put it back there so you know it's in your stockpile. And this guy goes back to that deck, right? Yeah. yeah. Before we get too far into this, we probably should mention for the people watching this, if you're watching this to, like, Think about acquire this game. Yeah, you, that's not really possible. <laughs> no, <it laughs> not it, not it if you're saying. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot that part. I always stick that at the end of my rules explanation because I, I when I usually teach this game, usually someone's gaga about it, and then I have to break them the bad news that by the way, this game is out of print. Will probably never return to print, and is some obscene number of dollars if you actually want a legitimate copy. Uh, right. Yeah, you, if you're interested in this game, play it online or look into print and play yeah. uh, variations of it. I'll, I'll yeah. put the, uh, since it's not going to be for sale, I don't feel bad about mm -hmm. it. I'm going to go ahead and put the uh, print and play link in the show notes. So you can click on that and print it out all to your heart's content. All right. Uh, so, so I went and so Dan. Yeah, my action. Um, I am going to Craftsman. And Craftsman, That's you can move a card right. from your hand and a new side. You can start, start, yeah, start. start a building, start a building, or, um, which is what I'm going to do, or move a card from my hand onto a structure. So if I think I either draw up to my hand size, draw a single card, or get a senator, right? That is correct. Gosh. 
I want both of these buildings. Ah, uh, no. This is well. You should you should start one of them then. I know. I'm giving you the opportunity to start the building. Right. I'll lose my craftsman to follow. Okay. All right. He's following. I'm going to use my senator to follow. And I'll just set that in the wait. That doesn't go in the pool yet, right? Or can I just set it in the pool? Um, we're not manipulating the pool with the craftsman action, so I think you can set it here. The one with, where it matters is like laborer, um, patron, and legionnaire. Um, uh, do I want to follow? I'm going to think. Okay. So I'm just going to take one card because my hand limit is five, right? Or my start start hand is five, so. All right. Um, I'm going to start this as a building. Let's see what you got going. Holy monkeys. I can, yeah, I like the crane, I like any, any card to lead or follow an architect role. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Check this it's one what out. I'm doing. You may perform one labor action for each influence that you have. Okay. Yeah. All right. So that means I have I start with two influence, right? You start with two influence. That's and correct. This will give me two more, so that's like four labor actions. Yeah, but you might even complete a build another building before you finish this one. That is true. That is true. How that's the true. resources flow? Yeah, I just like that. I think that building's broken. So, I like it. So well, so is that like you get to do that one time upon the completion, or is that ongoing? Yeah, upon no, completion. That the foundry it says specifically on completion. Okay, so. that's what I thought. All right. So I'll have like at least four resources. Okay. Well, I'm building this one, which whatever I uh, lead or follow, I can double use my patrons twice. That's when leading cool. or follow, each of your clients may perform their action twice. Okay. Nice. Cute. That's a good one. Uh, yeah, that seems pretty busted. Yep. <laughs> Here, don't forget uh, your insight card. What do you need for that? So that's a stone building, so it is one of the harder ones to finish. Yep. Just be careful when you're drawing in tabletop simulator because you want to make sure you're only drawing one of their base. Uh, and Pete, you already drew your card? Yep, I drew my card already. All right. James, your lead. Oh, man. Whatever is the winner of this game going to do? I don't know what <laughs> I'm going to do. Yes. <laughs> uh, wow. I uh, like that a lot. So we got Craftsman. Um, I am going to play. Hmm. Which one do I, I want to lose? This is these cards are hard because they they they're so awesome. Whoa. All right, I'm gonna play patron. So I'm gonna be a patron. Okay. Oh, wait, can I? Yeah, it's from the pool to my clientele. So yes, yes, it's one of these. I am gonna think. So I'm just gonna draw a. I can draw a senator for what I think. Right. right. Yep. Not all of them, though. Just one. Yep. <laughs> And again, if you just press the it's number, it'll, it'll only draw yeah. one. The number, the number is the easier way to go. To go. I'm doing this. I'm doing the same thing. Oh wow! So if I patron, I'm definitely gonna get a card. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. I didn't think I would because you know I was last. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and get a patron as a patron. Um. Yeah. No, that sounds fine to me too. Seems like a good idea. That means I just get more next time I do it. Which well, what do you call it? You, do are, you are limited by your influence, so you're like Two. maxing yourself yeah. out quickly. That's not saying I'm going to build something, though. 
All right, so that would be Nathan's turn. Yep. I am going to start attacking with a Legionnaire. Okay. So he doesn't reveal his card yet. We have to decide whether we're going to follow or, or think. How's that? Demand a card from your neighbor's hand and pull and move it into your stockpile. Yeah. So he just steals a card from me? Well, when it resolves, yeah. So so I'm, uh, this is one that I wasn't 100% sure again. Um, so whatever whatever card he calls for, whatever commodity he calls for, does he get all of it from the pool or just one from the pool? And, or all of it okay. from our hands or one from the hand? It's, it's one and one. Uh, okay, just we, one and one. Well, the last time I taught this game to you guys, I think I might have actually gotten that wrong. I told you that you got all of it from the pool, but it is just one. Okay. All right. Pool, That's good pool, to know. You mean your hand, right? Not pool. Well, I get one from the pool and one from everybody's hand if we have it. Yeah. Oh, if adjacent have it. players only. Like this legionary isn't going to hit me at all. Oh, just Darn. adjacent players. Oh, okay. Yeah. I got you. All right. And so then I have to decide if I'm following or if I oh, so am. So you could just like, it could round Robin. So the person that did the legionnaire could end up with nothing. No. What? Well, no. Well, his legionnaire is going to resolve first. So if Pete decides to think, he's going to draw up to maximum no, no, after say, the legionnaire resolves. Let's say he and follows, I'm, and I follow. So his resolves, he gets his cards. Peter's resolves, he could get his card back. Uh, no, and then mine resolves, I can steal from Nathan. Too. Well, no, because you have to reveal the card that you're looking for on resolution. So if Nathan takes Pete's only stone. Pete can't uh, take stone back. But if he had two right. stone, he could. So the, yeah, I, if he had two stone, he could. So the so first I'm, player could be losing on this. Hey, okay. don't they go... Uh, the ones you draw go into your pool, but they have to be pulled from the... I mean, to your stockpile. They go to your stockpile. Yeah, so yeah, you yeah. can't all, steal back all, the ones all, that I... Yeah. yeah, all the cards go to stockpile, too. Yeah. Yeah. So I am just thinking. Okay, I'm down to three cards, so I think I'm actually going to be thinking as well. But but I'm not drawing a card yet. You said because. Well, I'm setting aside the cards that I would be drawing here. Oh, so those don't count when he does his attack. Right, right. When, when his attack resolves, those I'm cards thinking. aren't in hand yet. I literally well, only have one card. He has a one in four chance of getting it. Okay. So we're I've all got, thinking, I've got a full apparently. Hand. I've got a full hand, so. You get one card then, right? So, well, I'm not drawing a card yet, right? I wait until after he maybe takes yeah. a whole bunch of my cards. Yeah, that's that's correct. Okay. Oh, so he could get two cards? He, he could. Oh, okay, cool. All right, so Nathan, what you picking? So I have to reveal a card to From show what card. Yeah, Can I show- do Senator to get a card that I don't have? Uh, nope. Senator is only a wild to lead or follow a role. Okay, Not in that case, I will do Merchant. Okay, so Stone is the, the resource that Rome demands. This is why this is the Rome demands board oh, is yes. here. So, so uh, there's no so, Stone in the center, so you don't get right. anything from that. I'm unaffected by this. I Pete do apparently have one. is hand, handing you a Stone. And I have no Stone. All right, so you get this one. What happens to and that goes, that This card goes to Stockpile. Yep. The, the card that he's holding, he, the other one goes back to his hand. Right. And oh, now okay. this this brick goes to the pool, and then we can all draw or draw our cards. So it did not do terribly well out of that, but okay. I mean, you got a resource out of it. It's not, hey, yeah. not bad. It's, you got a resource out of it that wasn't in the center of the table, more relevantly, I think. True, I stole it out of somebody's hand, P- Peter's hand. Well, I, I will tell you something. He did do. He did take the card that I really wanted. Oh, what does this do? The catacomb. Oh, oh yeah, it's, it's oh, the, oh, finishes okay. the game. The, okay, yeah, the catacomb is the card that ends the game immediately. Score as usual. Okay, yeah. yeah, that was the one I wanted to build. So good job. Well, that, that's okay. The card that immediately ends the game and you win is still out there somewhere. So. Oh, okay, all right. Well, I'll keep my eyes open for that. One. <laughs> <laughs> you mean the one in uh, my hand? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think we're on Pete's. Uh, yeah, lead. we're ba- yeah we're back to uh, back to me now. Huh. All right, so uh, let's see. I still don't have one of those.
Uh, I can see where this game gets crazy. It gets crazy with the building special powers stacking up. Yeah. Like right now, it's not even remotely crazy. We'll get to crazy. Don't worry. Yeah. No, I see. I got some. I got some nice cards. I, the only problem is I have like, do I want to do this nice card or this awesome card or this right. card that doesn't look right in any way? <laughs> I will. I will say that, um, like. More so for Nathan than you, you James. But starting with a, a building that takes three resources to complete, um, this is going to take a while. Mm -hmm. yeah. Starting with a building that takes one resource to complete, my wood building, that that that's a little yeah. like this is kind of like the the move that you want to look look for in the super early game. Not that yeah. you can't get to two relatively quickly, by the way. No, and I was looking at it for like its chaining factor. So I thought that was cool. Yeah, I just didn't have anything cheap in my hand. Oh, he has right, so folks. Oh, wait. <laughs> I am going to go ahead and craftsman. <laughs> craftsman. Craftsman. No. <sighs> okay. All right. Yeah, I'm going to use my senator to follow. I am going to think. I am going to use my senator to follow. Okay, resolution. All right, so then my... from so from my hand, I will start a new site. Or yeah, from my a hand new, onto building, it. Yeah. yeah, start it. Start a new structure, and I'm going to start building an aqueduct. So I need one of the concrete concrete sites. Maximum mm -hmm. clientele size times two. Sweet, yeah. That's pretty good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if I can make it happen, let's see. All right, so I've started that one. Okay. I am going to uh, play this wood, add this wood from my hand to my... Uh, whoop. There you go. Now they're stacked to my crane. That'll finish it. What does your crane do again? Uh, I'm sorry. I can use any card to lead or follow architect. That's good. This is one of the cards that they changed in the Republic edition of the rules. So this one was one of the few that were too powerful for the the, the Republic version. What the Imperium version, which is what we're playing, <laughs> is slightly more broken by like half a dozen cards. Sounds like fun. <laughs> There's cards that they consider too powerful. <laughs> yeah, well, that one Architect's pretty crazy. I like architect. So you can architect. You can move a card from your hand onto a new site, or start. I can structure. start a new building or move structure resources from stockpiles to yeah. structures. Um, just one Jane, card though. You do. You drew your card or whatever. Yeah. Nathan, you. Uh, oh you, yeah. Uh, I mean, filling I mean, a structure. Yep. Putting this into the structure. Yep. So uh, if I can get it. Stone under it. Okay. There we go. All, All right. right. So then, Dan? Yeah. Yeah. Let me think what I'm doing here. I'm down to three cards. You'd be like, I think. Okay. So does that I mean, mean I need one more uh, material uh, there no, or two more? Yeah. Two more. The, um, the two site more. itself does not count. The yeah. site from the center of the table. So you need two more stone. I mean, I want to do a thing. You want to do a thing? Do the thing. I don't know what we're talking about, but you should do it. <laughs> I like these cards. So stupid and awesome. Okay. <laughs> um, I am. I can use any card to lead or arch follow an architect. Cool. I'm going to use a merchant to lead an architect. I. <laughs> so architect is the lead action, not merchant. I'm going to grab a senator. <clears throat> 
I am following with Architect. Um. Architect is from from stock hand in, from stock. hand on his structure or stockpile on his structure. Yeah, you don't even have they, a structure to put those. Though. What if it's I, from you, stockpile? It, it's it, to fill a structure. It's from stockpile. Making creating a new structure is always from hand. Gotcha, gotcha. All right, uh, yep. So I will follow. Oh shoot, I should have put this wood up here forever ago. Um, but yes, I will follow as well. Okay. So my, I'm going to start this villa. Okay. James did his already, so I'm going to go put that in. That goes in the center, and this gets added to my building. And then I'm pulling from my stockpile also to add to my building. All right. And then the cards that were played go to the center. And oh James, my you're gosh, up. really? So you're just automatically that the card's broken. So broken. <laughs> <laughs> what? All it takes is one stone and it's done immediately. Free influence. Pow. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> oh, <man>. Nice. <laughs> yeah. 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 Wow. James, your move. I know, I know, I know. I mean, um, it took me a minute to think of my last action, and I only had three cards to look at. I'm going to do... Legionnaire. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to follow. My last card. <laughs> with his last card, he says... Oh, then okay. you can't do anything. Yeah, and again with the leech. Again, oh, you have to reveal a card. Yeah, you have to reveal a card, but yeah. you can't do anything. Oh. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're, better, you're better off thinking with one card in hand. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, I'll think. Um, let's see here. Because, again, you have to have the thing that you want in your hand in order to right. ask for it. Yeah, that's 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 the way it works. Yep. All right. I am. I'm going to. Uh, I'm going to follow with my senator card here. Okay. I'm declaring think as well. I'm just going to stick one card there. I'll draw however many uh, I need to when it happens. All right. So, so James, I, I'm demanding you're bricks. demanding. Okay. So I I, I have no. <laughs> I have no brick. I get. Oh, you get. Them. You get Nathan's. Yeah, <laughs> Which one, I right? kind of gave away. Yeah, but. you get the one from the from the pool, and so you, you get, get these two. And I do not have one either. Well, it doesn't touch you anyway. It only hits. Oh, that's right, players. adjacent people. That right. card goes back to hand. So now so, it's Peter. Th yeah, that's well. My think hard. I get five his, cards, right? His think resolves, and he draws up to five. Yeah. Oh, Yay. sweet. I mean, he's got, he's got cards that I might be able to take then. Yay! Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah this is true. This is true. <laughs> All right, but Dan's only got one card, so I uh. do in fact only have one card. This is why I declared think. Yep, and yep. what is it? I'm not gonna <laughs> say. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I am going to be. Um, I'm going to be looking to get uh, stone. Oh man, you lucked out! My one yeah. card went up stone. You get this so, one from the center. Yeah, get that Plus one from one the center. One from Nathan if he's got any. Yay! Oh, look at that! Aces. Look at all my stone. That's fantastic. <laughs> I'll take all those and put those in my stockpile. Thank you, guys. All right. Well, and now I'll resolve my thank, drawing up to five cards. <laughs> That's a lot of stone. Yep, I'll take it. All right, Nathan, what you doing? Um, yeah, it's kind of screwed up my plan just now. <laughs> What? You wanted that stone? <laughs> I had no idea. I, I sort of needed one stone, too, but I can find it in my hand uh, with a craftsman action. Yeah. What? So he has a stone in his hand. <laughs> or a brick. I am going to patron... 
Okay. All right. Hmm. All right. So he's going to patron. Um, I'm going to think, which means I can draw up to my five, right? Yeah. All right. And I can go ahead and do that right away. Or do I need to wait? Um, yeah, you're not adding cards to the pool because you're not following. So I think that's good, right? Okay. Yeah. Um, I am going to declare think as well. I'll, I'll wait just to be on the safe side. Oh, all right. I'm, I'm thinking and I'm getting a senator. All right. So Nathan, you, you pick. Yeah, I'm going to take, actually, I'll take the architect. Okay. I, I thought, but I have a, a patron client, so I will also take an architect. Wait, I have a pa I thought, and I have a patron card client. Do I actually get to do it too? Yeah, yeah, you get to do it once. Oh, okay, cool. So I did. <laughs> Why are they? You, they're on top of each other. Just hit you to stick the the one that's on top on bottom. That goes here. This is going to yep, go here. Stick and there. There. All right. All right. Yep. <clears throat> that is awesome. Okay, so that goes in the center. I'm sorry, that was your lead, right? Yep. Okay. So, so now, it's Peter. now it's Peter. Peter. Yep. All uh, right. This was played previously, I'm assuming. Yeah, I keep forgetting to move them up there. I'm terrible. All right. Um, How dare you? I'm I'm the worst. At the worst. I am going. I'm going to uh, craftsman. Oh craftsman. my. Yeah, that that's will be the one that allows me to fill from hand. Yep, fill from your hand. Okay, I am going to. F am I going to follow? Man, that's that's. Yeah, no, I'm I'm definitely going to follow. All right, so if I follow, since I have a patron that's a craftsman, I get to do it twice. Yeah, if you choose to think, you can craftsman once. If you follow, all right, I follow. I get to do it twice. So. So then, Nathan, I yep. will follow. Okay, oh, look at you guys, everyone's everyone's following. <laughs> I see how it is. Yeah, All right, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. All right. so I'm going to go ahead and take from my hand and finish off my aqueduct. So that means whenever I perform a patron action, I may take one additional client from my hand, and my clientele is size is doubled. Yeah, and grab then I will the, I will yeah, be adding this yep, out of there, to my yep. influence. I'm going to stack these up for you. Thank you it's, very much. There we go. Yep. Um, so that my, means my, that means my clientele is immediately eight. Your limit, it, your, your limit is now eight. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. So yeah, time to start recruiting like a madman. That is correct. <laughs> um, I am going to add a single stone to the villa, which uh, automatically completes it. <laughs> Oh no, this is with a craftsman action. No. Right, no, so it's not automatically done. Uh, all right, well, I mm, maybe I'm starting a new building. Just a second here. Wait, this is a craftsman action. No, it's an architect. I no, have to use this is craftsman. This is craftsman, not architect. Yeah, oh, yeah, I, have yeah to, I have to fill it with an architect yeah. to oh, make okay, it okay. work. Right. Um so yeah, we'll just start a new building. We'll we'll start the temple. All right. So, but combo with your thing that allows you to start or follow an architect with any card, it basically means you're guaranteed to be able to do that. On yeah, as soon as as soon as anybody architects, I can I can pull that off. Yeah. Yeah. So what I did I, was I built a building and put down a brick for my hand. Since I get to oh, okay. it twice. You, you, yes, added you, it twice. A, you added a brick. You added a brick to the foundry, and I put down the new uh, insula oh. building. Okay, I'm gonna start a school, and I get one of these stone to put underneath. Oh, I forgot to get the wood. The site, yeah. I'm sorry. This is in the middle. Dan, I went ahead and moved this over to you. 
Yeah, no, no, not a problem. So what does school do? Uh, come on. I'll wait until they're done manipulating their their. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> that goes in the center. Oh wow, that's not too bad. So much wood. All right. So much wood out there. Yeah. Right. Maximum hand size plus four. Really, Dan? Really? Uh, yeah. Maximum hand size plus four. Yeah. Don't worry about it. And <laughs> we won't worry about it. <laughs> why? Why would we worry? Why would we worry that? Yeah, that's crazy stuff. What's Dan gonna do? Or wait, that yeah, that was yeah. What's Dan gonna do? Actually, I just realized I had a potentially better building for my my inner my synergy in hand. Uh, well, I, I, I I want to I want to architect. So I'm going to architect. There's an architect. Technically, I'm going to architect twice. Yeah, whatever. I'm thinking. I am also thinking. <sighs> Thank gosh. <clears throat> uh, let's see here. What do we say we're doing? Architect? Architect is the lead action, yes. I will be thinking. Um, and for my thinking, I will... Take a senator card. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm now. I'm going to complete the villa. Yay! Because it is an architect action. Okay, and then good. I have a second architect action. So I'm actually going to start another another building for my hand. My name is Darn. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh! All right, I think Dan's winning. <laughs> I, I no. mean, those, those those abilities are not active. Those are buildings. They're going to take a while to finish. Uh huh. All right, so, James. Did you already do your thing? Yeah, I did my. I didn't do my action, but I took. I, uh, I think. Well, okay. I get to think. I, I can think first, and then do my follow with my client, right? Yeah, I think you can uh, mix and match the order to your desires. Okay, so I can think, and then I can do the architect to start another building, possibly. Oh man! Did someone huh. take? Did someone take one oh, of the out whoops. of town here? I, I, that was me. I oh, okay. Did that. Way to go, Dan. Actually, I'm oh, do I want to do that? Yeah, I know I did <laughs> twice. <laughs> oh, maybe I'll do this one. So I'll start this building. Actually, I, I just realized I did it with stone, too. <laughs> I'm terrible. <laughs> it's understandable. It was the one closest to your side of the table, so... Yeah, there should be two out of town sites in each pile. Okay, now we're fixed it. Oh no, okay. you win automatically if you have all six types of clients in your clientele there. Oh Dang wait, that. did he get the forum? Oh dear <laughs> God. Okay, yeah. Um, that's a problem. He started the. <laughs> so I can do my client again, and I'll do the form this building. Well, you think, right? So you only get to do yeah, it once. Yeah, he, he only gets to do it once. Oh, no, I haven't formed that building. Yeah, I fin haven't finished that building yet, so sorry, yes. I need one more. Yep. Ha-ha! Thank you. I tried to cheat. All right, so it's my turn. Or, Peter, did you do your thing? Uh, yeah, because I just thought and I took a senator card. All right. I Against my better judgment. I this is your one. lead now, right? Yeah, I'm going to do Architect. Architect. Act. Okay. Act. I mean, I do get to do it once for free. What happens when I, will I, think. When I complete the building with the, the resources, they just stay underneath the building? Yeah, that's right. Okay. I will also be thinking, and I will take a Senator card. Yeah, mine's just going to be a senator as well. What you doing? Um, yeah, I'm thinking, and I'm going to drop to five since I've only got one hand. 
You get plus four to your hand, though, right? No, that building's not done yet. Oh, it's not done yet. That's right. So I get to put a brick here. This goes on top. And these go here. Make sure I have the right one on top. Okay. I do get that it was it was architect, right? Correct. Okay. So I think I'm going to start another building from my hand. If it matters, I, I get four resources from the... I'm actually doing the same thing, too. I can do that as well. So I stole all those resources. So all that's left in the pool is wood. Sounds great. And an architect card, wherever that went. Concrete. <clears throat> okay. Does that make it my turn? Is everybody set? Yep. I think so. I am going to do... Patreon. Okay. Uh, Okay. Doesn't give people much options, which is fine with me. It does not, but I'm going to follow with my senator okay. card there. Of course you are, because you need to. Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm going to declare think uh, taking a senator. I'm okay. Think taking a senator. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to take one of these craftsmen. Mm -hmm. Add to my clientele, I, and I'm at my max clientele for the moment. Yeah, mm -hmm. Pete. Pete's Thanks. gonna be able to grab whatever. Mm -hmm. So I, yeah, I'm gonna grab one from the pool, and then also add one from my hand. I may take one additional client from my hand. The one I played that doesn't go into the pool until the end of the round, right? Yeah, the the card that you play to leader fall actions doesn't enter the pool until everyone's done with their actions. Yeah. So I am going to take uh, – which one of these do I want to take, Architect or Craftsman? Are you allowed to build the same building twice? Um, You are. It may or may not help you. Uh, yeah, I get that point, but yeah. Um, I'm going to go ahead and take uh, the Architect. And put okay. that into my clientele. I'm adding the senator to my hand, and I've got a a free patron over here, so I might as well take a craftsman that's left. Um, and I'm also adding in from my hand. Um, a laborer. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And James just thought, right? Yeah, uh, yeah, I got it. I grabbed the senator. So now it's uh, Peter's turn. turn. <clears throat> okay, so put my senator back here. And then let's see how I want to do this. Make sure I'm doing it right. Do the right thing. I know what you, I want you to do. Oh, I'm sure you do. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go ahead and patron. With my senator card here. Again. Again. Uh, um, well, I'm declaring think. Wait, what did you do? What did you do? Patron. He, he's he's patroning. What? Oh gosh, why? I need to I need to build a stupid building before you patron. Sorry. Can, yeah, I, grab no, a, can I have two senators? Uh yes. Alright, well, I'm getting another <sighs> senator. Uh, I'm going to have to think. I might as well do my draw. All right. All right. So then for my Senate, uh, for my Senator, Ooh. I am going to take one of these craftsmen. And then I will also be putting another one in from my hand. Uh, and that is going to be a merchant. Wow. All right. Uh, I thought that well, was going to win, I, but now I'm not so sure anymore. <laughs> I, I I'm gonna draw my one card from Think. Uh, I can patron, and I don't really want double patrons. Um, but I guess I'll take a second craftsman. Also, oh, you pay you patroned as well, Dan. Well, no, I had a client. Oh, okay. I got. You. I had one client. You, so you I had a patron client in there. Yeah, I, I I was able to claim a. Yeah. Oh wait, wait! I can follow because I forgot I have four influence. So I'll grab a second. I forgot about that. My bad. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I, I thought and follow. So because I had a patron. Yeah. Yep. Because you had it in there. Your clientele. Whoopsie. I could have done that last time too. 
All right, my go. Yep. Yep. Your go. Well, um, I have some options now that I have all craftsmen. Uh, so I think I'm gonna craftsman. Uh, so I'm gonna craftsman a total of three times. So I can Dang. craftsman up to three times too. And yep. craftsman means that I can move a card from my hand onto a structure or start a new structure. Oh man, should I craft them twice or you know I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna hog all the senator cards. I'm gonna take another one. So I'm only gonna craftsman twice. Okay, I'm gonna follow with my senator so I can <laughs> craftsman. What if I have a hand of senators and no one has senators? That's super cool. So, uh, so if I'm just remembering since I haven't done this much yet. So you are craftsmaning, which means since I have it over my clientele, I can do it once, plus I can think as well? Yes. So then I'll go ahead and uh, think up to my hand, so I get four cards. Okay. Uh, I'm going to start resolving mine. So one of my craftsmen will it be to complete this latrine from my hand with this wood or rubble. Uh, one of them would be to add a resource to um, this card. Did you complete another building, or you just have one building complete so far, right? Uh, just one. The latrine fe was finished, because it only takes one resource. Okay. And I'm, um, I am I even using the now the question got like two non senators in my hand. I don't think I'll use that ability. I mean that one's okay. I'll start this tower. Starting a tower. All right. So for my that's all three of your actions, right? Yep. For my one I finished my um Insula, which uh, increases my maximum clientele by two. So I have seven that I can put in there now. Uh, okay. And my, for my second one, I'm going to do... So I don't know how this one works exactly. I'm assuming that you place the building... Uh, the statue on any site. The statue can be completed with the materials of that site as or marble. Yep. So if I say that it's beside this guy, right, then it could be stone or marble. Well, no, no, no. Uh, like, normally if you're making a marble building, you have to take a marble site. The statue allows uh, you to take any site from over here. Yeah, and whichever one you, you want. You finish the building with marble, which is what the statue is, or whatever site you picked. And that thing's so worth my, six victory points if it's finished. Well, it's worth three. It's uh, plus three victory points, so it's three plus three, right? If you picked marble as your yeah, site. Yeah, you might which choose I did, one of these. Which I did, yeah. Oh, you did, okay. okay. All right. Because I have three marbles. <laughs> All right. Okay. So you done, James? Yeah, I guess. I'm done. So I'm taking both of my act, craftsman actions to finish this building. Now, I think I initially misunderstood it, but I think I got it now. Uh, so now I can immediately take four think actions. Sure. I yeah. kind of thought it was ongoing, but which, uh, but yeah, it makes sense. More sense. So my first think action is I draw three cards. Yep. So I now I for the next three I can either draw one card each or I can just draw senators. Senators. I can essentially draw three senators. I don't think there's three. Well, yeah, I left. think there's only one left there. Oh, but you so can the replace senator. the senator that you played. Yeah. 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 I, that's true. I pulled that one. And then just well, one you, extra card. You can't pull. The oh no, one I can't pull that one. Yeah, I have two more cards. Okay, so I have a huge hand now. Okay. 
Um, all right, so I have a quick question then for my craftsman action because I thought for my first one and then I'm craftsmaning because my clientele. Um, but I need a marble structure, but this one is out of town. So how does that play again? All right, yeah, I wanted to mention that now that, that now that we've got so Since once the in town sites one. once the in town sites are exhausted, there's you can uh, build a building on an out of town site. But it takes two actions to do so. Okay, so since I'm only using one, I can't do that. Oh, right. I see, I see, I see. So, so to James, build a site yeah. out of town, it takes two actions. And that's interesting. In the black box version of the game, these out-of-town sites are actually not worth influence on completion. But these look like they are. These look like they are. Okay, but sense. since I'm using, but since I'm only using one craftsman action because I had to think first, then I can't actually start because I'm using only one craftsman here. Right. Ah, ah. So you can start a building, but it can't be a marble building. Correct. Which is what I wanted to do. Oh, man, I I'm like sorry. You you declared think right? Uh, yeah. So I oh I thought, and now I'm using my craftsman here to because he's yeah. in my clientele, so I can okay. only craftsman once. Um, shoot. So what, well, yeah, what building am I going to start? Um, I knew what I wanted to do. Um, I guess I will start. Sure. I'll do that one that Dan's got going over there with his stone, that villa. Oh, okay. So I'll grab one of those, and I will put it under there. All right. That completes that <sighs> turn. James, your lead. I'm not sure what I'm going to do here. It is so crazy how long the turns get as everyone starts to... Ramp up, yeah. Ramp no, up for sure. That one was a pr pretty long because we all did something. And right. It was something, a lot of something. Yep. I'm going to go ahead and do Merchant. <clears throat> okay. Oh, interesting. He's shipping resources. <laughs> yeah, I don't have anything in my stockpile to ship. So. Uh, I'm getting enough. Think, it, well, the only, the only person I think has any resources is Peter. Is so. me. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I, I did that on purpose. <laughs> so. All right. So, yeah. So I'm going to think. And by thinking, I'm going to take a. I, oh, I no, I'm first. not going to take a senator. <laughs> Dang it. He's got all the senators over there. All right. I'll take one card from the deck since I can't get a senator. I'm sorry. How many senators are there total? No idea. Were there six? Sounds I about have two. So I shipped a brick. I've got I've got one senator. You've got two, Nathan. How many yep. do you have, James? I have uh, two in my hand. I have no two, senators. Four, five. All right. So okay. I so no, there's only five senators in the game. The game plays up to five players. Well, don't so, forget that I have one on the table too. Yeah, I'm thinking that you probably can only have one at a time, probably. All right, I'm going to throw that guy back. So should I put mine back? Yeah. One of your two. Yeah, I'll Don't just worry. throw one. So Peter could have taken one, but oh It's well. all, right. all right. Yeah, well, then I should have got two cards. So, there we go. so you're only supposed to have how many? Only one senator in your hand at a time? Is that yeah, what we're saying? I, I'm, I'm thinking because the game maxes out at five players, and if there's only five senators available, it just sort of makes okay. sense. All right. Ooh. So then it is my turn, correct? Or is it? No, it's Nathan's oh, no, turn. No, no, it's Nathan's turn. I just finished. It's Nathan's turn. Okay, so. I'm sorry, what was your action, James? I shipped a brick. He merchant. Oh, okay, I, yeah, I did not do anything. Uh, oh, I forgot you, did, to, you yeah, didn't get I, your cards? Yeah, I didn't get my cards. There you go. Now I've got cards. All right. This seems like a good time to patron. With nothing <laughs> in the pool? <laughs> not, a, not a whole lot in there but he wants to do it i mean he does get first pick so he's guaranteed a card he is it's true and i'm actually gonna follow 
Yeah, yeah. So it's just me and Peter, which I would rather Peter wasn't able to follow, but oh well. Well, that's what happens. Well, he'll get one <laughs> you didn't want me to follow you. You didn't lead. Um, what? He'll get to get one from the pool and his hand. Yep, I get I get two. Interesting. What was this from hand? Because yes, down here I have the aqueduct building, and it allows oh. me to do that. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I'm going to declare a thank. I'm also declaring a thank. All right, go ahead and grab your clientele. All right, oh, so I'm... Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. You're good? Yep. All right, so I'm grabbing a second craftsman. Uh, let me put that there. Okay. Uh, and then I'm also, yep. from my hand, going to add... Patron. Okay. Uh, okay, so that goes in the center, then it's Peter's turn. Where is Um Oh yeah, let them do their when, things. When I when I thought I had the option of discarding a card to the pool, and I will do so. I will discard this card to the pool. Interesting. Okay. Okay, go for it. Uh, how do I get this to show? Ah, yeah. Ah, no. I can't, still can't see all of them. There's one more down there that's it's not as organized as I would like it. But oh, this one. Yeah, it was that. It was that one there. So see, it hides it. All of a sudden, this this craftsman goes over top. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It'll be. Yeah, there we go. All right. Um. All right. So let's see. Well, how am I gonna do this? How am I gonna do this? You have too many clientele, Pete. The the game is telling you you have too many clientele. I know, right? It is. It's starting to me. plug out. Uh, shoot. Move a card from your hand onto a site. All right. So if I play. I want to double check. If I play architect, because I have architect here in my clientele, that means I could use those two actions to start one of these marble out of out of towns. Yep. All right. Then that is what I am going to be doing. I will play an architect, and you guys can choose to follow or not. A stockpile architect, or I could start yet another new building. All right. Uh, nope. I'm going to clear a think. I'm following. <clears throat> I am following. I just threw a brick on, or marble under my statue. That's all I did. All right. Then I am starting an out of town marble structure with my two actions. You're out of town. <laughs> right. I am. And I am starting, just so Nathan knows. The forum. Oh shoot! Do you just oh shoot! I'm one away. But so you're missing. Building first. You're missing a legionary. I'm missing a legionary, but I also have to finish that building. So he has no yeah. marble, though. So we have to make sure he never gets marble. <laughs> um, I thought, and I'm also going to use my ability to add a card to the pool. I think. Um, let's see. What does these do? Okay. Oh my. I'll add that card to the pool. Oh, I should have done this. Oh, wow. Wow. I wish I had that earlier. All right. So, what you doing over there? Okay. So, I'm just going to start two new structures. So, one of them is going to be this green structure. So, wood. You may use any material towards the completion of stone. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I desperately need, uh, and then I will start. Your client. Uh, wow. I think I'm going to try this bath. Performing a patron action. Each performing actions. 
as it enters your clients. Okay. All right. So I think it's uh, Dan's turn. Yep, it is Dan's turn. My lead, huh? All right. Um, I'm playing a senator. My declared action is laborer. What does labor do? Oh, move from um, stockpile. To collect place. resources from the center into stockpile. Um, <laughs> I don't have any clients, so I can only get to do it once. I'm going to go ahead and follow with laborer. I will follow with laborer. Well, uh, using a uh, senator. I will also follow with laborer. Uh, because, well, in my clientele. And then I will um, think before okay. that. All right. So. so let's see. What resources do what one resource do I actually want? Uh, I guess this one. I'll take a concrete. I'm gonna take a marble. And we can't let me, or Peter, have marble, right? No, that's, that's your took a marble. That's your goal. Yep. Yeah, so I guess I'll take the marble. No marble oh. for Peter. <laughs> All right. Well, then I will take a stone. Right, because the plaza is still a thing. <laughs> And then I also get to think. Uh, so I'm going to grab all my cards. I need to be able to finish this stone building. Jeez. And then you should, there should be a laborer for Dan too, right? Oh, he used his. Uh, he used I used his, my. Yeah, I used the wild. All right. <clears throat> oh, man. So is that everybody? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I right. think. So now it's James's. Yeah. Whoops. Through that way. Sorry, I'm sorry, we threw it at you. We threw it. <sighs> sort of almost can't do anything. Um, sure, I'll steal from the pool again. I'll do laborer. Okay. I will think, which just means I get one card. Let's see here, laborer. Oh, I should, well, no, that's fine. Yeah, I'm going to think the laborer. Thing. I'm also going to think, and I will take one of the senators. No, this should be here, right? Yep, thank you. Um, and then I also do I do get to follow because of my clientele, but I thought as well. Okay. So, yeah, so you get to pick a card. You get, did you already get yours, James? Yeah, I got mine. Okay, well then I will take um, I'll take the concrete, I guess. And put that in my stockpile. Okay, I'm going to stick. I'm going to use my my ability to uh, stick a uh, brick into the pile. Okay. All right, so that was sad. Nathan's turn. <clears throat> we don't want Tim to... Oh, no. Why would you put a brick in this pile? Mm -hmm. <sighs> do I do what I want to... <laughs> or do, what do I want to... Uh -huh. <laughs> ah, his brain's breaking. <laughs> so I can either do what I want to do, or I can keep Peter from winning now because of what Dan did. Yes. Well, what it called? He still needs to finish the building. But yeah. Like, yeah, my building's not done yet. That's true. I have no marble in my stockpile. I don't know what you guys are worried about. <sighs> I kind of need to do this though. Um, no, yeah, I'm gonna do no. craftsman. Craftsman. Okay. All right, craftsman. That's from hand? Yep, from yeah. hand. Huh, interesting. I like it. I like it, Nathan. I like how you think. Mm. So from hand, I could start a structure. I can craftsman twice just for my clientele. Yeah. So, um, yeah. So I'm gonna think, but then I'll follow twice with my clientele. Okay. And you said we can only have one senator in our hand at a time, correct? Yeah. 
All right, well, then I will take a card from the top of the deck. I'm going to think. I'm declaring think here as well. Okay, so but I've got craftsmen to resolve off my clients. So yes, go ahead. Me too. So for my first craftsman, I'm going to finish this building. So that means I can use any 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 material to finish a stone building. So I'm going to use this concrete to finish a stone building. Uh huh. Now all my uh, all my clientele happened twice. Oh, I, yep. So those buildings are complete. All yeah, right, three so then, buildings complete. All right, so it's my turn to go ahead and craftsman twice for my clientele. Mm -hmm. All right, well then, from my hand, I'm going to add a stone under this villa here. Um, and then from my hand, I will also start a building and I am going to start this palisade which will, if I finish it, allow me to be immune to legionary. Ooh. Okay. Gotta start getting our legionnaires out before he finishes that. Alright. Um... Before I think, I'm going to discard a card to the pool. I'm going to take my two cards. Yeah. And then I've got two craftsman actions. Uh, so add a resource to the tower. And we'll add a resource to the temple. All right. I have two craftsman action. I'm going to add a resource to my statue. And... I'm going to play the sewer. At the end of your turn, you may place order cards. You usually either follow into your stockpile. Okay, yes, yeah. Yes, that's nice stuff. <clears throat> okay. I am going to. Oh, I'm sorry. No, it's Pete's leads. Yeah, it's my Pete's lead. lead. My lead. All right. Um, for my lead. Shoot. Can't do that. That's not going to help me. Hey, what steal card? my card? <laughs> what, what card? I my don't card. know what I how that happened. I pressed my arrow keys to move around, and I must. All right, I guess I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'm gonna labor, which means I'll get to laborer twice. Collecting cards from the middle for resources. Yep, you get to move them to your stockpile. I will dissent. I yeah, uh, um, I'm going to think. Declare a think. I'm also going to declare a think. Draw three. So everybody's thinking? Yep. Yep. All right, so I get to draw two cards from the stockpile, or from the pool and put it in my stockpile. Uh -huh. I am going to take a stone. Marble. Our stone is no marble. If there's there was no any marble. Marble. yeah, if there yeah. was a marble, that would have been great. But no, there's not. What was the normal end game trigger again? And then I'm I'll sorry, all the in town sites are exhausted. Oh wood. Or we're run out the deck. Okay. 
There's 52 cards left in the deck, and it looks like there's only five in-town sites for me. Or the third option, somebody plays and finishes an I win card. Yes. <laughs> All right. That was that was my turn. Everybody okay. else thought. So Dan, you're up. Uh, I didn't resolve my think. Oh, sorry. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna toss a card to the pool before I think, uh, and then I'm gonna draw up. So two what do you mean more. you get to toss a card to the pool? What's that? Um. I'm sorry. Uh. Here we go. Latrine. Before performing a thinker action, I may discard one card into the. pool. Nice. Right. All right. Uh, so I am now going to play Senator, and my declared action is Patron. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> so I will descend Patron. Unfortunately, I have to just think and get a Senator. Uh, since I've got a patron here in my clientele, I will also think, um, and then uh, I will follow. Okay, uh, I'll take. And taking the red card, right? Laborer and legionary. <laughs> yes. Okay, that's <laughs> all right. I will take a craftsman. Oh, actually, oh yeah, I do have a follow, so I take a. I have a. In my client. So. Yep. I get the laborer. So I will grab the last one out there, which is hey. a laborer, but then I also get to play one from my hand. Which will be a red brick. I'm sorry, there's this green card here that was with the senator or senators. Yeah, for some reason it, it like disappeared from my or I had in my hand. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right, so I took the laborer there and then also, yes, from my hand is the legionary. Oh, so you could win now. If I can finish that building, <clears throat> yeah. but I have no way of doing that so far. So, oh, actually, technically, I could have patron twice because I had to you... double patron. Yeah. Any any of my clients, I can do twice. Yeah. So that would have meant that I would not have gotten this green laborer card. Yeah. Yep. But there you go. I got so. But I still, I still got my one from my hand, so that's fine. Yeah, that's, that's what all I really is. needed. Yep. Uh, that's all I needed. So anytime I labor, I can do it four times. Now. <laughs> I mean, if the pool ever gets resources in it, we're play, playing it pretty tight to the chest. True, I'm true. Gonna, I'm going to do merchant. I don't have any merchants in my clientele Ugh. i'm just gonna and peter I, have I, one merchant. I do have a merchant yes uh i'm gonna go claire follow i've got a blue card and it is worth points so i'll take it so let's see what else do i want to do do i want a merchant there's nothing out in the middle of the board right now that this is correct. Yeah. Um, I will actually, I can follow with a senator, right? Yeah. Allowing me to merchant twice. Yeah. Yep. So I will do that. I will play my senator, and I will merchant also a second time with my clientele. Yep. All right. Ship your goods. Uh, All right. Ship some marble. And I again, just, you only have as many places in your vault as your influence, right? That is correct. Okay. Oh, you've already shipped before. Yeah, you sh yeah, you shipped once. Uh, you shipped once before, and he was able to follow. Yep. Yeah. So I've got three things in my vault right now. I have two. So I'm almost. Um, my vault is almost full. Oh yeah, yeah, he didn't build much. All right. Yep. Nathan, I'm sorry. Oh, if your hey. if your influence is for oh you know you've got the building that doubles your clientele size. That's how. That is correct. Okay. That's why it was the first building I finished. Uh huh. Uh huh. All right, Nathan, what you doing? I am going to Craftsman. Oh my gosh. Ah. Going to Craftsman. So that means I get to do that twice, and I'm also going to think. Which means I'm going to go ahead and draw two cards. 
<laughs> I'm thinking I get to go do it three times. Yeah, I get to do mine three times as well. So I'm I, gonna. I'm. Oh I'm boy, I'm declaring think. I mean, I'll get to two craftsmen regardless, but you know, go for it. Dang it! Wow. Okay, I am starting amphitheater. Upon completion, you may take one craftsman action for each of your influence. Okay. All right. And then I am adding two cards to this bath to finish it. Wait, how are you adding, doing three actions? Uh, I get double for all my clientele. Oh, okay. Yep. Yep. All right. All right. So you finished your bath. Yes. You smell much better now. All right, Peter. <laughs> Thank you. I was all wondering right. if that joke was going to happen. Yeah, it uh, did. It did. So, yeah. So I get two craftsmen as well. And craftsman is all from the hand. I don't have anything to do. Uh, let's see here. Wait, when do I resolve my draw? Oh, whatever. Think I resolve. Uh, Think I. What do you call You 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 resolve actions like in turn order. Okay. If it matters. Um, I will start. Then a rubble building here. Only took the last site. And for my rubble, for my rubble, I am going to uh, yeah, I'm going to start uh, that doesn't help me as much. Maximum clientele, maximum clientele. <laughs> oh, that's all you need is more maximum. Tell. I know, or or when performing patron action, take additional client from the deck instead of from the hand. So sure, why not? I'll start that. So um, I oh, so crap. with my first yeah with my first craftsman, I start that, and with my second craftsman, I complete that. <laughs> Sounds great. So right. yeah, I'll, I'll I'll get it. Yeah, thanks. All right, so that's an. So the next time I patron, I can pull from my hand and from my deck. Um, but I really don't need a ton more patrons. I just I need freaking marble. My action was think. I'm gonna I'm gonna discard a card to the pool. Uh, take my two three cards, and then I'm gonna take two craftsman actions. No, yeah, no craftsman was. So one of them will be to finish this tower. Whoops. Um, now the tower is finished. I can use rubble and any structure. So I'm going to finish this marble structure with a rubble. Nice. Oh, I forgot to take my rubble for this building I started, by the way. All right. You forgot to do what? I forgot to take the rubble for the building I started last time. Oh, okay. I'm going to add a... And then I guess I can add a resource to this building. All right, those are my three. I'll uh, I'll need to fix up my player board, but go ahead. All right, so I'm playing a. Oh wait a second! I only had two. A foundry and adding a brick to it, and I added a stone to my sewer. Okay. Okay, so that goes in the center, and Peters gets the first player. Okay. Um. Let's see. Um, I'm going to go ahead yes. and take the architect action. Okay. Uh, so, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to declare a think. I'm going to follow. I will declare a think. And I get to do that twice. 
because I have architects here and in my clientele. So I'm going to take both of my stone from my stockpile and finish my villa. I am going to, for my think action, I am pitching a card to the pool, and then I'm drawing my hand sizes now. Hmm. All right. Your hand, your hand size is what now? Uh, nine. Nine. <laughs> Heck yeah. So I just finished the stone statue thing. Come on. Dang it. Okay. Did you have more to do or are you done? No, I just had the one architect action. So I will, th I'll do my think first. So I draw two cards and then I do architect twice. So first architect is going to be a brick to get rid of one of these rebels and get us closer to the end of the game. And I, you said I can do the same building twice. Yeah, it, yep. the special ability may or may not benefit you. It doesn't really, but uh, and then my second uh, architect's going to be to put that in underneath. Okay. All right, Dan. Okay, You're my up. lead. My lead. I've got a lot of options. Um. Wow. What you going to do? You should architect. No. No, uh, I want resources, so I think actually my best option is Legionnaire. Ooh. I, I am Legionnaire. I am Legionnaire twice, incidentally. Okay, well, I'll declare the thing. Oh, wait a second. Dan, yeah. you, did the, you did a villa earlier, right? Yeah. So I only actually needed to put one stone under this? Uh, yeah. Use the architect action, yeah. Well, dang it! If, I did. if you use the architect action, that's what yeah. I just did. Yeah. Okay, then it's done. <laughs> it's done, but I have too many stone under here. Is what I'm saying. I'm oh, put one stone I back. see that now. Yeah, I'm just gonna put one stone back into my stockpile. All right, Nathan, you uh, following or thinking? I am. What was it again? Uh, Legionnaire. <laughs> <sighs> we'll think. Which is just Can you hear me to Legionnaire, right? Uh, no, I have not finished the building. Oh, haven't finished the building. Excellent. But I do, but it doesn't matter because I'm not adjacent to him. No, I, you're you're adjacent. I'm the one that's leading. Oh, you're leading Legionnaire. Well, I'm going to follow with my clientele, but I'm also then going to think, but I won't pull anything until after you're done. Oh, no. Okay. Mm. Uh, Are you following so, Nathan or are you doing something? I just did think. Okay. So, okay. Peter, or uh, Dan, I'm sorry. Oh, I suppose I should flip. Oops. All right, Dan, Dan so first. since we get two, the not. first one's going to be a toss away. Um, I'm going to reveal, not that one. Um, I'm going to reveal uh, Marble as okay. my first resource. Nope. Hoping that you guys have some. Nope. I no? do not. Okay. All right. Well, the second one's definitely going to admit me something because I'll pick something that's in the middle. Um. Uh, We'll just go with uh, concrete. Definitely get this one. There you go. I got nothing. All right. All right. So then, James? I just draw my hands. Then Nathan draws up his hand. And yep. Uh, my, so you're, James, you're not doing any. Okay. No. Yeah, you don't have it in your clientele. Okay. All right. Um, so I do have it in my clientele, but first I'm going to go ahead. Do I, I go ahead and draw up my, my deck? Because I'm thinking first. Sure. All right. And then... What am I going to ask for? All right. Uh, um, guys, right. I just got, a, just got the call, as it were. I got I to gotta grab lunch, and then I got to head. So uh, you guys can finish this out. Hopefully there aren't... 
Hey, ho- hopefully well, before, it's going to end before, out. All right, before, hopefully it's going to end go, out. Before you yeah, go, I'm hopefully asking, it's for, end I'm asking for concrete here. Oh, before I go asking for concrete. Yeah, I got one. You okay. this too. Yeah, no, you, one oh, yeah, yeah. I don't get it. Get and, any for you. That's fine. You guys should finish out relatively quickly. Probably. Um, I have at least 14 points if you need to know how many points I have and where okay. you stand. All right. I'm out. Thanks have for the a good game. One. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and play Senator to Architect. Okay. Nathan? Uh, architect. That's the one from your stockpile, huh? I will not follow. I will just think. Okay. Peter? Um, let's see here. Architect, I get to follow at least once for my clientele. Um, and it doesn't really help me a whole lot to do anything else. Um, yeah, so I'm going to I'm going to think and then I will also follow with my clientele. All right. So I'm going to play the brick under this foundry, completing it, so I get up to 10 resources from the middle, so I just take everything. Dang. Wow. <laughs> nice. All right. Next. All right, and then I will... Um, I, I, will I will... I will, from my stockpile... Oh, wait, I do still get to you, too. Sorry, before you do yours. Uh, I will... What does this do? Uh, wait... Say it's coming from your stockpile, anyways, and you have nothing in your stockpile. Yes, but I can build. You can, it's true. I can use two build actions to build this and immediately to get the out of. Do I get oh, this? To get the out of town, yeah. You so I actually the take the out of town thing? Yeah, if you if you used two actions to get it. Yeah. Okay. So nobody can build that? Oh, there's no, there's an infinite pile there. Okay. No, there's not an infinite pile. There's only, I think there's only ever two out of town. Okay, yeah. All right, so then it's my turn? Yeah. Okay, then I will use my one architect to pull from my stockpile and finish this wood building, the palisade, which means I am no longer affected by the legionnaire thing. Well, I'm not playing legionnaire then. (laughs) Yeah, because I just... I have all the resources. All the resources. Okay, so my turn. That goes back to this card. Ooh, okay, so you very much limited what I can do now. That's <laughs> awful. There's nothing. Well, I could always do. Okay, I can do this. I'm going to do my senator to do a craftsman. Oh my lord, thank you. So I get to do three craftsman actions? Yeah, but are you following? I've got to see here real quick. So this is from your hand, start a structure, or from your hand, fill a structure. Um... I mean, I'm already going to get two, so then I'll do those two, and I'm just going to draw a card from the top here. Oof. Ooh. All right, so I I'm going to do a draw for it, but I get to do lit, uh, architect or uh, craftsman three times. So what are you yeah, doing, Nathan? Let me do my actual craftsman. So two of my craftsman actions are going to be finishing this building, which is the uh, forum. Yay. Uh, my third craftsman action is to finish this uh, tavern. Okay. Oh, come on. What is the ta- The tavern is uh, one relevant to patroning. Okay. And that's it. All right. Then I will use my two craftsmen to take this and start a concrete structure and my concrete structure is going to be uh, 
Um, sure. Start the wall. And then my second action will be, shoot, will be to place uh, a concrete from my hand underneath there. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and just end the game. That sounds good. So I'm going to play, do I want that one? Uh, which one's better for me? Actually, no, doesn't matter. I'll just add, increase my max size. I get the labor thing, and then I'll just finish it. So this gets to be up here. And this was the color. Doesn't matter. Uh, and then my for my third one, I'll just throw... I can't even do that for my third one. All right, so that's, that's the game. So that's the game. So now we're just counting up victory points. Yep. Yes. And those are coming from our vault. Our well, we'll influence. Do the vault last. Yeah, but yeah, our influence. And that's so it. Inf influence, influence is first. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I've got nine in my influence. Fourteen in my influence. I have eleven in my influence. Plus I get a bonus three. So I have fourteen. Nice. Now we do vault. Yep. Okay. Nothing in my vault. And what do you have in your vault? Uh, three, six, nine. Nine more in my vault. Wait, nine? Yeah, because it's the it's the amount of coinage at the bottom of each of those cards in your vault, and each of mine are stone, so there's three each. So nine. Right? Uh, isn't this for... With the I most think, I think you get one point per thing in your vault and then the most, right? Or is it the, just the most? Three points. Oh, no, it's just the most, right? So you got three points. No, no, I'm pretty sure you get three points for each card in the vault, or you get points for what is in the vault, as well as if you have the most, you get the plus three. I could be wrong, but that's... How oh, I yeah, yes, it is. Combined value it. of cards in your vault. Plus, if plus you have the most of it. For each oh. market merchant bonus card, so that's these. So I get the so, merchant yes. bonus card for stone. I get two merchant bonus cards and five more okay. points. So All right, so then that's actually not nine. It is 12. So 12 for Peter. I get zero for that. James got... Six, 11. 11. Which, which merchant cards did you end up getting? Or... Marble Most of for your vault, marble. Brick. Nice, well done. I didn't diversify enough. Well, I don't know. Okay, so oh, then if you have any points, go ahead. And then if you have any buildings that give you victory points, I, I was gonna say yeah. So it's so it's, again, it's just the vault and your influence points, and then any bonuses that your building might buildings might give you. Yeah. All so right. I so, I have this as I have fourteen. Peter has 21, and James has 25. I think that's correct. That's what I got. Woo! I just couldn't get any marble, man. Yeah. That's how it, that's how it is. Yeah, because Nathan over here, he was able to finish his forum, but then he just couldn't fill up his clientele. I filled up my clientele. I just couldn't finish the forum. Yeah, he, if he hadn't wiped out the center, I probably would have won. Yeah. That and really if I, powerful. I was going to say, if I had remembered the whole end of uh, these points over here, the merchant bonuses, yeah. if I had at least played one of these concretes over, then I would have gotten the bonus for that as well, which would have given me another five points, and then I would have won by one point. I was trying to make this engine that I never... I forgot about the diversification there. Yeah. I was trying to make this engine that never worked out, but the engine was, um, I was trying to get in my clientele merchants. Oh, okay. And I was and I was pulling all these cards into my stockpile, and I was just going to so ship them all out. Yeah, yeah. Getting things getting things into your vault and expanding the size of your vault is really uh, is it's a really good engine to have for yeah. sure. And like I said, I I did merchant a couple times, but I forgot. Uh, I always forget about the merchant bonuses at the end, and so I forgot to diversify my vault. I was hey. all stone. Yeah, I never saw any laborers until really late game, so I didn't really have much chance to get anything in my stockpile. Yeah, there's still 21 cards left in that deck, too. Yeah. 
It's a fun game. I like it. Oh, man. I am totally printing this out and making it. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I was going to say, I, 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 don't, I don't know that I'm going to get to play it often enough to print it out, at least not yet. Uh, so right now, whenever I play this, it'll be on here. So, uh, But this is, I think this is my third time playing. James, is this your first time? First time ever. Nice. Beginner's luck, so we have to move on. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, yeah, good game, guys. And Dan almost yeah. made it to the end of the game, so. Yeah. yeah, it was really close to the end. So, who wants to flip the table? I do. I do, I do, because nobody freaking gave me the flipping marble. Oh, sure, right, sure. You go, go for it, you go for it. I tried, it wouldn't let me. Ah, uh, you failed. Oh, uh, I... Uh, I, I don't think I've ever successfully flipped the table. I was going to say, oh, oh, there it is. <laughs> the Star Wars one was the best. It just went off into space. Oh, yeah. Well, guys, thank you. What a great way to start the day. <laughs> yeah, no, this was awesome. Yes, it was definitely worth Definitely all the hype is uh, right about it. Yeah, it is, it is a fun game. The first time I played it, though, I really didn't understand the... I really didn't understand the aspect of how each card is like three different things. Yeah. Um, and I didn't get the engine building of the clientele. I didn't understand it. So like, I think by the end of the game, I only had one client in my clientele. And I was like, oh, no, like I missed like a big part of this game by not doing that. Yeah. Um, so but yeah, now that I feel like now that I understand the game, it is it is it's a lot of fun to play. It is an awesome game. I like it a lot. Yeah, so, it, it, which, again, a, it just makes me so sad that it's that it's out of print and that it's not going to be coming back. Cause yeah, it, yeah, it's yeah. Just, it's super sad because it's a really, really good game. In this playthrough, I did see a slight drawback in that I didn't have anything that was cheap to build, so I had a very slow start because of that. Right. Yeah. And yeah, it, my, my and it kind of limited my actions too because I didn't have the the, the nice starting actions which were yeah. the cheap buildings. The hard thing for me with the needing the marble was that one, you guys knew what I needed, so you wouldn't put it in the middle of the table in the pool. But I, I can't remember how many times I thought after that and kept pulling cards from the deck and never got a marble from the deck. Yeah. So you know, yeah. sometimes that that luck just doesn't work with you. Yeah. It's yeah. Like me and the merchants, I could have crushed it if I got merchants. Right. Ah. I was having the same start uh, trouble with stone and that until I finally built that building that just let me use any material instead of stone. <laughs> yep. So there's some cool broken cards on this. I like it. Yeah. Yeah. It, it definitely ramps up and there's a lot to pay attention to once you get going, but it starts, starts you off nice and easy. I was going to say, this is definitely a game you want to be playing with people that you, I mean, not that you don't normally trust this people that you sit down with, but it gets to be that there's so much happening. I just have to assume that you all are playing properly because there's no way I'm going to keep track of everybody's play. So not with us necessarily. Yeah. <laughs> so. I don't know. I, I didn't see, I didn't like, I saw, the, I looked at all the eyes guys. I thought you guys got all the crazy cards other than the one where I get to do the labor action like 8,000 million times. Oh, right. Like, I didn't get anything like super crazy in my hand. Mine were all like I pretty pretty much drew the same cards repeatedly during the entire game. Oh, and I was I was so glad I had the card that would like allow me to end the game pretty much whenever I wanted by finishing the building, and then Nathan yeah. had to steal it with his first Legionnaire move. So, <laughs> uh, well, thanks for playing, guys. Yeah, thanks yep. for playing. That was fun. It's quite a lot.